Hello everyone, welcome to today's video where we'll be delving into the fascinating world of nonlinear circuits. In particular, we'll be exploring the concept of a nonlinear component known as a diode and its behavior within a circuit. To aid our understanding, we'll be utilizing a circuit simulator that consists of a 1K ohms resistor, a diode, and a variable battery source ranging from 0 to 20 volts. Explanation of Nonlinear Circuits Before we dive into the specifics, let's take a moment to understand what a nonlinear circuit is. In a linear circuit, the relationship between voltage and current remains constant, following Ohm's law. However, in a nonlinear circuit, the relationship between voltage and current is not proportional and can vary depending on the components employed. This introduces intriguing behaviors and characteristics that we'll explore further in this video. Introduction to the Diode One of the most prevalent nonlinear components in electronic circuits is the diode. A diode is a two-terminal device that allows current to flow in one direction while blocking it in the opposite direction. It serves various purposes, with rectifying alternating current, AC, into direct current, DC, being one of its primary applications. Understanding the behavior of a diode is crucial for comprehending the intricacies of nonlinear circuits. VI Characteristics of a Diode When we analyze the behavior of a diode, we often refer to its voltage current characteristics, commonly known as VI characteristics. These characteristics describe how the diode responds to changes in voltage across its terminals. By observing the VI characteristics, we can gain insights into the diode's behavior within a circuit. Voltage Current Graph In our circuit simulator, we have assembled a simple circuit comprising a diode connected in series with a 1K ohms resistor. With the variable battery source allowing us to adjust the voltage from 0 to 20 volts, we can observe the corresponding current flowing through the diode. By plotting these values on a graph, we can visually depict the VI characteristics of the diode. Discussion of the graph Let's examine the voltage current graph in detail. As we gradually increase the voltage, we notice that initially, the current through the diode remains very low, almost negligible. This behavior occurs because the diode operates in a region referred to as the reverse bias, where it blocks most of the current flow. Essentially, it acts as an open circuit in this state. However, as the voltage across the diode reaches a certain threshold, known as the forward bias voltage, an intriguing phenomenon occurs. The diode suddenly transitions into a conducting state, allowing current to flow through it. The graph demonstrates that the diode possesses a threshold voltage, typically around 0.6 to 0.7 volts, for silicon diodes. Once this voltage is exceeded, the diode starts conducting in the forward direction, permitting a significant amount of current to pass through. Conclusion In conclusion, nonlinear circuits, particularly those containing diodes, exhibit unique behaviors that differentiate them from linear circuits. By exploring the VI characteristics of a diode, we can gain valuable insights into its response to changes in voltage and how it influences the overall circuit. Understanding these characteristics is crucial for designing and analyzing circuits that incorporate nonlinear components. Wrap up. I hope this detailed explanation has provided you with a comprehensive understanding of what a nonlinear circuit is and how a diode behaves within such a circuit. If you have any questions or suggestions, please feel free to leave them in the comments section below. Remember, knowledge of nonlinear circuits is essential for any electronics enthusiast or professional. Thank you for watching, and stay tuned for more informative videos.